Welcome back to Danganronpa! My name is Paul Guy. My name is Mark Man. And that's the emphasis. We are men! Manly men. Men playing Danganronpa! <laughs> a game that has girls in it too, but that's fine because we it's all good. Because as men, we love women. And we love men. And <laughs> we love everyone because men are men. And men, women, men. And, I uh, love men and I'm gonna <laughs> love the men. And the men are very lovely because the men are very lovely. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Last episode, we spent a long time trying to figure out what's upstairs. We found out there's a library and a yeah. swimming pool. Yep. And then the very a end. Very hidden swimming pool. Very hidden. Add, yeah. Very well placed hidden swimming pool. Now, things have happened. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, there could be a murder afoot. Murder. Uh, so everyone's looking for Mr. Uh, yeah. Uh, and, yeah. But we're going to go to the second floor, right? Yes. Yeah, so he might be... We're a, thinking that... Our in, character is thinking that he might be upstairs looking for... Uh, in the, or exploring again. In the library. Yeah, he might have... Been, you know what? He might have... God dang it. How do you get rid of this man? Thank you. I got it. Thank you. Uh, he might have been trying to throw us off by like, why would you go into the archive rooms when he wanted to all along? Ah! I'm just throwing guesses out there, but I guess we'll see if, I, if my hunches are correct. Oh. When I opened the door to the library and looked inside... I cried out in a sudden surprise. Uh oh. Oh no. Byakuya? Oh. <laughs> oh god, you're. Still... Oh no, he's reading! You're still you! <laughs> <laughs> of all the things I imagined, this most definitely wasn't hey, one of them. Uh, what are you doing? It's, it's, I couldn't imagine so let's voice act. Fishing. What does it look like I'm doing? I'm oh. trying to read, so if you could be quiet. Oh. But it's breakfast! Sorry. But the pancakes! Wait, no! What are you doing here? Everyone's super worried. We've all been looking for you. Who asked you to yeah, do that? that? Because we're all supposed to meet up in the morning and eat together. We made a promise. We made a promise! We made a promise, <laughs> Mr. Fiocchio! A promise! A promise? Yes! Yes! What I said! We Can't just said that! A seconds peace and quiet around here. No! Wow. <laughs> no! Byakuya snapped his book shut and slowly stood up, smooth and silent as a shadow. A very rich shadow. Meanwhile, the others must have heard me yell and started showing up one after another. Yeah, we're getting a party in here now! <laughs> Byakuya! This is where you've been hiding?! What the heck you doing here, man? We were very concerned! Well, you had no reason to be. I was just reading. I never I have never read such a coarse novel before, but it might just prove useful at some point. Well, what are you reading? A mystery novel. Well. Wait, so are you gonna use what you're learning in there to betray us? Don't be stupid. Yeah. Yeah, don't be stupid, you piece of shit. It's just something to keep in mind. Yeah? Ooh, it's very ominous. What? Actually. If I decide to fight, of course I'll come up with a something... God! Something original. Otherwise, this game of ours would be totally boring, right? <laughs> it's not often you get to take part in such a high-stakes, high-tension activity. So if you're going to do it, you have to make sure it's entertaining. <laughs> These words sent a chill down my spine. There was an undeniable smile on his face as he spoke. He looked like he was actually enjoying himself. Enjoying this deranged killing game. Damn you! What the fuck do you mean game? That's fucked up! But it is a game. It's a game of life or death, which can only one, which can have only one winner. That's all there is to it. He is right. It's a zero-sum game. What? Are you okay with this? It is a part of game theory, a mathematical model. In game theory, what we are going through now is called a zero-sum game. In this type of game, in order for one person to gain something, another must necessarily lose something. 
In other words, it is a situation in which participants must compete for position or resources. You mean like a uh, card of elimination match? Entrance exams, sports tournaments, job openings, most social interactions fall into this category. Everyone must scramble to obtain something which is unlimited. For you to succeed, someone else must fail. This also applies to the school life when we've been subjected to here. In this case, our limited resource is that only one of us can successfully become the blacking. So in other words... So this game was designed from the beginning to force one of us to try and defeat all the others. That, that can't be what they had in mind. <laughs> this is why adaptation is so crucial. If those want to escape or to disappear, there will be no reason to continue playing the game. What? But why would I want to stop playing? It's so much fun. What the hell? He smiled again as he spoke. The evil. The smile was filled with evil intent. It's twisted. It twisted his face into something not human. It sounds as if you do not acknowledge even the possibility you may lose. Am I right? Naturally. Of course. <laughs> You do not speak like the others. Exactly what I would expect from the Togami air, apparently. Oh. It's just normal arrogance, isn't it? Just a second! You talk like that? But what if you end up dead? Not possible. I won't. I will hope you're dead next. It simply isn't possible. You son of a bitch! <laughs> Who the fuck do you think you are? You know, I still just can't believe What? It. Believe what? That an uneducated, oh, oh. brain dead, useless piece of garbage like you has survived this long. Piece of shit! I'm gonna fucking kill you! <laughs> like I said, I won't die. You keep saying that. Oh, sorry, shit. Ma! Oh, sorry, my hair spoke up. Yeah, my hair you spoke keep me. saying that, but. Do not bother arguing with him. For him, the concept of losing simply does not exist. He is the ultimate affluent progeny, after all. A boy raised to succeed from the day he was born. He considers victory his destiny and has lived his life accordingly. Tests and challenges are merely ways for him to stand victorious, even if it is a life and death situation. <laughs> is that not so, Birkia? <laughs> well, at least one of you seems to understand. It is because I am the same as you. Games aren't meant to be one. Games are meant to be one. That's enough. Are you trying to suggest we're on the same level? Close that vulgar mouth of what? ours. Oh. oh, well, well, I do apologize. Anyway, let me just say this to all of you. You all need to try harder. If an opponent isn't going to give it their best, where's the fun for me? No. That's a terrible way to look at it. What? Hmm? It's because... This isn't a game. Our lives are on the line, you you know? To kill your own friends is... It's is, horrific! It's horrific, like I just said! Yeah, I'm speaking up! Friends? Who decided that? Huh? huh? We're not friends. No, quite the opposite. We're in competition. We're enemies. But... But you, you know... But what? Stop trying to force your contradictions on me and just accept what I'm telling you. Um, come on. Yes? If you have something to say, say it. Otherwise, keep your mouth closed. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop fucking around. Hey, shithead! You get off bullying people that can't fight back? You want to try that on me? So you're back to pretending to be friends, huh? And how long do you think that's going to Piece last? Of shit! Yeah, that word. <laughs> Those words. <laughs> Fuck you! What? Is that all you can say? Fuck you, yeah! It's Fuck you! It's unfortunate that you would waste your breath on such empty You gym. son of a bitch! That's it! You are fucking dead! Just a second! Hold on! Just calm down! Piece of shit! I am calm! <laughs> How is this calm? Hmm. Anyway, I don't have any intention of working with the rest of you any longer. To cooperate during an elimination game is... Well, frankly, it's a waste of time. And I hate wasting my time. Waste of time? Engaging in friendly group meals is out of the question. Someone could easily poison our food. And I'd rather not become part of the Last Supper just yet. Shit. 
quit talking like you're a fucking movie or something. All I'm saying is that, ultimately, you're all free to do whatever you want on your own. Goodbye. I fade away. Without a second glance back, Byakuya left. It wasn't any... Wait. I think he farted on his way out. Oh, oh what a douche. Oh. There wasn't anything we could do to keep him from going. Because he phased through the wall. His way of thinking was just beyond anything the rest of us could even comprehend. But, uh, was he serious about all that? He was, without the doubt. Don't fuck with me. Well, fuck him then. Maybe. But what he said, he might not necessarily be wrong. I mean, can you say for sure someone won't? poison our food hey come on you too toko anyway well it's not like anyone would care even if i was gone right <laughs> right <laughs> mark's like yes yes actually i bet you all want me gone yes you all think i'm d disgusting well none of us think that except mark i i do <laughs> I'm telling you, you just think you don't think that okay i know some people like to play the victim but this is just totally out there, like my hair. You think I don't know? But I do. You want me gone. Yes! And I'm heck? sure the rest of you want the same thing, yeah. don't you? Fade away! Uh, hey, Toko, wait! Just let her go. Once she gets going like that, there is nothing you can do say to bring her back. Fine. Ultimately, our breakfast meeting came to an end without answering any questions. And we didn't get any pancakes. And we didn't get no frickin' pancakes! Everyone headed back to their rooms. With no pancakes. Jeez. I'm tired already. But I don't have time to take even one day off. What do you mean? There's nothing to do no, in here. Say, just, I need to get myself going. That's, I need to hurry up and have my free time. All right. So can we go to the shop and spend these coins? I feel like that's something we should do. All right, hold on. I'm just, buttons. Mm -hmm. So, he, so our suspicions were proven true that he is in fact a douche. A big old d bag. I was kind of hoping he'd be dead. I want to do another trial. It's a, a, lot, a lot of fun. A lot of fun. I have a feeling. I just have a feeling that we're gonna. It's gonna be a hot minute before we uh, get to that point. Yeah. Plus, we gotta get our free time. All right. Let me spend these eighty coins that I have. Or sorry, eighty-two. Eighty-two coins. All right, what do we got here? You like try your hands against all of my dudes? Yeah, sure. Yeah, give it a shot. Give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Eighty-two coins. So how many? Uh, how many coins do I want to put in? Let's put in. I'm gonna split the diff. No, cause oh. the more coins you put in, the the repeat goes down. So you want to make sure it's. Oh, so one at a time? No, no, two. So we put two in. So now we have a hundred percent chance of not getting something. Okay, so I'll put two coins, coins in. What do we got? Yeah, rock! I got this. Silly putty. All right. Okay, I see, I see. So now it's three coins. To not get a repeat. And I got this leaves. This bag of weed. All right. <laughs> uh. So, I, so the more you do this, the more like it increases to... Yeah, the, the okay, shades. Ooh, nice. Sweet shades, bro. Oh, God. Lucky? Oh. What happened? A free Second item. Second prize! And it's just a punch to the face. Uh, I don't know what that it is. Looks like, it looks like flowers or something. Oh, my God. I'm going to be here all... Okay, we'll do it one more time, and then I'll figure out what to do with this stuff. Yeah, nuts. All right, get some nuts. All right, let's, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I should probably get going, you know, I don't want to, you know, it's like Vegas, you don't want to spend any more than you actually can put forward, so, you know, yeah, I know, okay, um, so then what, uh, who, who are you going to talk to in your free time? That's a very good question. How do I check my, oh, my presents, there we go, I want to see what I have, because I don't even know what half that crap was. Oh, sunflower. Sun, sunflower seeds, seize the new, oh, there's, oh, Oh, there we go. They have a flavor somewhat similar to peanuts. I bet you that Leon would have loved those. Baseball Aww. player loves seeds. Glasses. They say that wearing these while performing incantations will help you better speak with the target of your spell. Who's uh, 
Does isn't the hair guy like a clairvoyant? Oh, that's right, the clairvoyant. Yeah. Uh, a loincloth meant to emphasize one's manliness. Its simple design features of a single leaf overlaid on white cloth. Uh, Sakura would love that, isn't that? Is that... <laughs> I, well, mm. oh, you know who? Maybe Mondo would like this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah he kind of had. He had like that, like that bro band mentality. Burn and keeping promises. Oh, cherry blossom bouquet. Uh, collection of bands. In the language of flowers, cherry blossoms represent a woman of superior beauty. Well, I give it to Swimmer Lady. I mean, I would too, but I'm not sure if she would appreciate it. Uh, moon! Moon Rock! Truth. <laughs> rock taken from the sea and going to the moon by Astro. <laughs> Just taking fright from the moon! Uh, apparently used for where it was found. Uh, I think Chihara would like that. She's like the, the nerdy girl, right? I think so. Uh, well, we, we had one of those. Um, wait, what? yeah, we didn't even, like, look at them. Oh, this would have been good for... You gave that to Hina. I think that would have been good for... Small light. Common wisdom... Uh, turning small, but nope, it's just that the light itself is about the size of a matchbox. Small light. So that might be... That might be hair, too. Like, all these, like, mystic... Mystic stuff. Hmm. Oh, and then I got despair back. <laughs> Forgot the oh name. yeah. There we go. Proof that you cleared chapter one. The name really doesn't sound pleasant. Creates a foreboding sense of something very bad has begun. Why would I give someone that? Okay, I won't have question. Have this bat. Right. <laughs> have this bat. <laughs> All right. All right. What? Well, so. Okay. So we have some gifts that I think Hair would like. Um. But do I want to? Do I want to? Uh. Where is he even? Mr. Hadamon! There you are! Right in the boys' locker room! Hey, let me in. Is it you? Oh, 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 hey now! Hey! hey now. Oh, uh, this is that. Oh, Mr. Uh, this guy. Ugh, when are we gonna get out of here? Hmm, should I hang out with Hero for a while? You know what? Why not? Just some two boys hanging out in the locker Just room. Just two bros broing it out. Oh, I got two something to show you. Two guys sitting in the locker room six feet apart because they're not gay. <laughs> Remember that vine? <laughs> it was a hot tub. <laughs> it was hot tub, yeah. Oh, I got something to show you. I got the stigmata on my back. Come on. What? <laughs> it's a gift from the gods. Like my hair. Hero showed me a scar on his back, though I didn't really get what it meant. Cool, thank you. That's pretty neat. Hey, I grew a little closer. Would you like to give him a present? Yes! Absolutely! I got some things you might like. Hold on, let me see. Not the seeds. What was it? The glasses. glasses. Here, have some glasses! Gib! Hmm. I wonder how much I could get for this at the pawn shop. <laughs> Great, pawn it away. <laughs> kidding, kidding! I appreciate it, really. Like my hair. Does that mean he liked could it? it be? Hey, Makoto. You know what I think? What's that? You and me meeting like this it wasn't a coincidence. Mm. So I got some good news for you. I'm going to give you a psychic reading as a huge at a huge discount. Oh hell yeah! A discount? How about that? Normally it's a thousand bucks for two hours, but for you, let's call it nine hundred. Oh, what a deal! That's only a hundred dollar discount, and even then, it's way Don't too expensive. Be mean. Hey, come on! You should count yourself lucky at the ultimate clairvoyant is willing to tell you your fortune. So are you right pretty often? I sure am. At the bare minimum, I've got a 20% oh, chance nice. of accuracy. Like my hair. 20%? That sounds pretty what sketchy. The heck? For real? Don't make that face. Didn't you hear what I said? 20% of the time, I'm right every time. That includes natural disasters, election results, you name it. Don't you realize how amazing that is? Wow, amazing. Uh, how about that? Okay, fine. I'll give you a special trial run. After all, I've already seen what the future has in store for you. What? When well? did you see it? <laughs> you won't believe what I saw. It would appear that the mother of your children and the mother of my children what? are the same woman. <laughs> I refuse. Denied. Don't like it. Right, right? Doesn't matter if you don't like it. That's just the way it is. Like my hair. 20% accuracy, you, know? you said? At least. 
And I pray to everything holy that you're wrong. Please be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> now then, since that was a special trial run, I'm afraid I can't apply the discount. That'll be $1,000, please. Don't worry. You can pay me after we get out of here. <gasps> Hold on. But there's no way you're going to be right, mm. right? If you like, I can do a reading right now to see whether my reading was right or not. Naturally, additional fees will apply, you know? <laughs> Think about it, okay? Let me know as soon as you're ready for my services. <laughs> Thanks for your money. That's him laughing to the bank with no money yet. Uh, he's gone. Do I have enough in my bank account to take another crack at it? No! I can't bring myself to pay for something like that! I can see how people would fall into that kind of cycle, though. <sighs> that was close. Please, whoever's listening, I'm begging you. Whatever else happens, don't let him be right. <laughs> Cool. I unlocked Lost in Thought. Oh, we have skills we can do? Oh, yeah, we got one from uh, Sayaka. I don't know if we used it, but I think we... Once we're all done, I head back to my room for a little while to look at the pink walls. And I think I got time to do another one. Yeah, another day, to. yeah. All right, I'll do a character. <laughs> I'll do someone you voice. So that way, <laughs> you're not just sitting there. Still plenty of time left. I can't sit here. I gotta hang out. All of a sudden, I go back to sleep. Alright. <coughs> Sneaky little snake. Sneaky little snake. Alright, who, who am I going to hang out with then? Uh, there's her and all the you. I don't know here. Uh, oh, uh, Hina's in there. In the dining hall. Um... <laughs> Alright, I'll go to him. I want to... I, I don't know. I, oh, is it like the sauna? He needs... Uh, is it? I actually didn't look at the room. It, it probably is. Or some kind of like a thing. Alright, Mr. Flatman. I'm just going to go, go, pardon me, I'm going to go to that door there. So, oh, it's oh, it is the sauna. It's like the other room in the sauna. Taka, you want to go in the sauna hey, with Taka, me? Taka, what are you doing? All right, this is what you get for being, whoa, where, where am I going? <laughs> Jeez Louise, okay. Just... Yes, I'll leave the sauna, the multi-layered sauna. Why can't I go back to the thing? The bathhouse, okay. Okay, here we are. Back where I need to be. This is so confusing. Okay, let me hit his kneecap so that way I'll know. Hey, Makoto, what's up? Hmm, should I hang out with Taka? Let's do it. What's that? You want to hear what I've got to say? Quiet down and listen. Very well. I've got many theories on many topics, and I'll share them all with you. Oh, boy. Let me get my pen and paper. <laughs> Taka went into extreme detail on some of his many theories. And I grew a little closer to oh, him. Yeah, see, my theory is, is that we're actually already dead, and we're, I'm, actually, I'm actually not dead, I'm a piece of cardboard. I'm in a video game, right, okay? So I got two people playing this game, and they're, they're reading me as I'm a, I'm a character. <laughs> I just took some flower seeds, just jam yeah. them into his mouth as he's talking. <laughs> oh, that's... Uh -huh. Maybe I was wrong about you, Makoto. Let's continue to deepen our relationship, shall we? <laughs> the way you said that took me by surprise. Does that mean he liked it? Hmm. Hey, Makoto, as long as we're talking, let's really talk. What do you say? Whoa, uh, sure, that's fine. Excellent. Hear me? Then, let's get down to brass tacks and find out where we stand in all the big issues. So, what should we discuss? Politics? The economy? International affairs? Dang, he don't pull no punches. Wait, hold on. Instead of a big, serious discussion, can we just have, like, a normal conversation? That's the best way to learn about people, I think. What do you mean by normal conversation? <laughs> Doesn't <Yeah>. compute. <laughs> uh, well, for example, what do you like to do in your spare time? Listen to me! Study! Of course! I'm a student, aren't I? Oh. Study, of course! I'm a student, aren't I? A student must be studying professional. Uh, and of course, my duties as the chairperson of the Morals Committee keep me quite busy. As well. You understand? It's my duty to foster an environment in which we can all focus on our studies. Okay, but what else? What else? Like when you're at home, or do you just have some time to kill? If I have time to kill, I study! I see. <laughs> This is fun! Okay, my turn, Makoto. What do you like to do in your spare time? Uh, you know, just normal stuff. Watch TV, play video games, be boring. Huh. 
And this helps you study how? Uh, no, it's not about studying. It's just for fun, you know? <laughs> but doing things just for fun serves no purpose. There must be more to it. You wouldn't want to spend your valuable time doing something useless, would you? Uh, he can insist all he wants, but in the end, maybe there is a good reason. Like getting into something and talking to people about it. So maybe... Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't get this for Hero. Um, shoot. I don't want to lie. Although it might make me redo it if I get it wrong. Um. I don't, I don't think oh, I got it. You, you know how she was full? It, it helps give you something to talk about with other people. Something to talk about? Like when you see something awesome on TV or some awesome game and you want to share it with someone or to tell people how boring you are over and over again. You find other people who feel the same way and that's how you make friends. See? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. This is ridiculous! I, I was once blind, <laughs> but now I see. Oh my God, Taka! Uh, what the heck? Ah! This kind of thing has plagued me for years. I tried making friends, but whenever I would make conversation, I would die just after a few minutes. And now I finally found the answer. <laughs> I need to study more games, <laughs> more TV shows. <laughs> no, you, you don't need to study them. Ah, I'm so ashamed of myself. God, <laughs> if there was a hole somewhere around here, I'd totally go hide in it. <laughs> I let it get to me. I wasted all that time. I never saw the blind spot in my study. I'm a complete embarrassment. <laughs> I'm not qualified to even be on the rules committee, let alone lead it. Uh, I don't think it's really that big of a deal. <laughs> oh, thank you, Professor Makoto. <laughs> P Professor? Ha, you taught me a most valuable lesson. You've earned my respect. And the title of Professor. Uh, that's gonna make things super awkward. <laughs> There's no need to be modest, Professor. Oh, God. I can't wait for your next lesson. Until then, I will strive to learn as much as I can on my own. Mm. Well then, Professor, by your leave. Oh, God. Without waiting for a reply, Taka ran off. Professor. Although thinking about it, I didn't totally hate it. Professor Makoto. Hey. I like the skill. Attentive influence. Cool. Well then, after we were done, I decided to head back to my room where I'm gonna get tucked into bed because Monokuma says so. Oh, wow, that was... <laughs> that was impressive. I don't know what to say about that, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> something crazy there. Did I talk to the right people, Monokuma? <clears throat> Hmm. That's an announcement. Soon the doors to the dining hall. Okay, Sweet. okay, great. Awesome, thank Good you for that. Good night. Nothing new. Another day gone. But even though today is over, this game definitely isn't. How long is this going to keep going? Well, all the stress and anxiety kept me from falling asleep until late in the night. Grand. Cool. Then I woke up... With a bunch of sweat around my face <laughs> and some saliva. Oh! Whenever I spot a cute girl, I have a tendency to stare. I can't help it! I just gaze with intensity. The other day I rode my bike to the I train station. I was in the bathroom, just looking at myself in the mirror. Mm. That was the I short... <laughs> I didn't expect that to be so short. Well, we're approaching the time anyway, so I guess it kind of worked out. So let's see if there's anything new real quick. Good morning. Get ready. Ready for another beautiful day. Okay, nothing new. All right. So here we are. Well, I guess I better head to the dining hall before anything else. And you better head to that uh, subscribe button and hit that real quick. Uh, just throwing that out there if you want. If you want to keep up with the series, it's a good way to do so. Also, we have a Discord and a Patreon. Both those links are in the description below. And uh, be sure to give the video a like and uh, share with your friends. People that you know like Danganronpa. And maybe they'll like uh, these two crazy guys playing it, you know? Who knows? Also, 
maybe hit the bell too, because I think that's supposed to let you know when it's Ding happens. dong, bing bong. Just your friendly reminder. Always remember to look both ways before crossing the street when you see a man in like a sauna bathhouse looking thing and he talk about studying, just still gonna talk to him. He's gonna have an emotional breakdown. <laughs> call your professor, it's gonna be creepy. So just don't do it. It's a roller coaster. See you next time.